fly ash simply a byproduct of burning coal in thermal plants so what do we get from fly ash oxides like silica aluminum and calcium you can also find the traces arsenic boron chromium and lead so what are the common problems of fly ash air and water pollution so for the disposal in a scientific manner dry fly ash and wet fly ash were introduced dry fly ash simply in the method of electrostatic precipitation and wet fly ash simply fly ash plus water we can find the uses of fly ash in agriculture in what cases like improves water holding capacity and soil aeration uh, this fly ash contains the micronutrients like uh, phosphorus potassium and calcium when coming to the the other industry which get benefited from the fly ash is construction industry it is used for manufacturing of portland cement so mobile app ash track is being introduced it acts as a link between fly ash users and power plant executives we can see the two key points about fly ash particulate matter 2.5 and gst rates on fly ash and its products were reduced these are the few key points of fly ash thank you